Hi everybody, in my prior video I indicated I was seeing issues with the Mavic 3 increasing its altitude as I flew forwards, backwards, left or right. That was in a low light environment and it was under a light snowy condition. The issue occurred mainly when I was flying at lower altitudes it seemed and when I was out at two other locations in that video I did not see the issue occur. Although I was a little bit higher up in altitude and at a different physical location. So in this video today we're out at a local park and we're doing some flying and some testing of the DJI Mavic 3 versus the DJI Mavic 2. And today as you can see behind me it's a bright sunshiny day. It is not snowing. So today we're going to see what kind of issues if any there are with the Mavic 3 out in bright sunshine. is our height and feet and we're going to go straight forward with the right stick so the drone should maintain 126 feet and not elevate. As you can see it's elevating at a rate up to like 8 miles an hour, almost 9. Now it's kind of held steady at 179 feet. starting out at the 33 feet elevation or altitude. And it's going even higher backwards. And this is what I was seeing yesterday, specifically going backwards. The height would tend to go up more dramatically. So here, kind of leveling out to about 54, 55 feet. And once again, we're elevating from 39 feet. We're up to 57, 58. And we need to stop there. So not touching the left stick, we're going left on the right stick. So this one is perfect, holding 59 feet in this direction. That was in normal mode with obstacle avoidance turned on. Let's turn off obstacle avoidance and make a couple runs and see if that makes any difference. Obstacle avoidance off. Thirty-two and a half feet, obstacle avoidance off, full right stick. A little bit of a wind, not dramatic at this height. 
site. And we're going to go in and set obstacle avoidance to brake rather than bypass. And do some runs this way. See if that changes anything. So straight back on the right stick. 20.3 feet. And that is about as perfect as it gets, 20.3, 20.0. So not a problem there. All right, straight left, starting out still at 20.3 feet. So with brake enabled so far, we've maintained our altitude at 20.3 feet. So we're batting 100. All right, go right full right. Started at 20.3 feet. A little bit of dip temporarily to 20. But back to 20.3, I would consider that to be satisfactory. Starting at 20.3 feet, going straight on the right stick. So definitely the comment asking about what happens when you do brake mode. The outcome is the same as when I disabled obstacle avoidance altogether. All right, so now we have the DJI Mavic 2 Pro. We're gonna do a couple flights here just for comparison against the DJI Mavic 3. We have obstacle avoidance enabled. We have a pass running. So here we are at 12.1 12 feet over the ground. I'm going to go right on the right stick, not touching the left stick at all. This is the exact same thing I've been doing with the DJI Mavic 3. The DJI Mavic 3 is raising an elevation. What will the DJI Mavic 2 do? So straight right on the stick. And gaining some elevation here in flight. Started at 12.1, right now we're at 12 and a half. Stopping.
right, straight forward on the right stick. Started at 12.1. Stopping. All right, and go straight back. Slight gain of elevation, letting go of the stick. All right, 12 and a half again. As you can see in those clips, my Mavic 3, when I'm flying with obstacle avoidance enabled and in bypass mode, has an issue where it's increasing its altitude as I'm flying forward, backward, left or right. Others in the comments of the DJI forum post that I made on this topic and in the comments of my prior video, which I'll put a link to below, they've indicated they've also seen the same issue since day one. So this issue may not be specific to the December 10th, 2021 firmware release. I noticed it the other day. I had my screen recorder on. I was going to do a long time lapse moving forward driving the drone towards the car, or flying the drone towards my uh, 2019 Dodge Challenger. And as I was doing it, the drone kept on changing its elevation. I'm like, what the hell? I'm not hitting the left stick to go up. I am only trying to go forwards or backwards. Why is this increasing? So I went out to do one thing, which was create a time lapse. And I ended up doing a whole different kind of a video, which was, hey, why the heck does my DJI Mavic 3 increase in altitude? If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and also consider subscribing to my channel. Also make sure to stop back and check out some of my future videos. I'm gonna be posting one of the Mavic 3 following my 2019 Dodge Challenger where the Mavic 3 flies itself right into some tree branches or in the middle of tree branches. So see what happens by subscribing to my channel and watching that video that I post in the future.